All right, so tonight we're going to do some smoked whitefish mousse. This is a great little appetizer and it's really light. I really like this one. So I was in the supermarket and I saw the smoked whitefish. And uh, it's such a great little, it's got one little piece and uh, we're going to open it up. Um, we don't want the skin, we don't want the bones. So we take out all the flesh. And uh, the smoke, it's a nice, I love this white fish. It's not a very strong flavor. So it's just nice and mild and it picks up a nice smoky flavor. Uh, I'm gonna chop all the meat up here. So we're just gonna get it all chopped up so it's quite fine. I would often use some chives, but I'm using green onion tonight. So I'm just using the base of the green onion. It's a bit sweeter with just the white part. I'm gonna cut it lengthways down the middle and lengthways down the middle again because I wanna mince it. So we're gonna mince this green onion. We're gonna mince a bit of uh, uh, red pepper as well. The green onion gives it a nice little uh, nice little flavor into when you mix it with the sour cream and the uh, the whipped cream. The red pepper I'm putting in more for just to add a bit of color. So what I'm gonna do is get a small piece of uh, red pepper. I'm just gonna take the meat out, I'm gonna skin it, and uh, I'm just gonna use the skin. I'm gonna give it a nice julienne and our fine knives, and uh, then just dice it up. Now when you're slicing, right, uh, there's something called the three finger rule where you take your fingers and uh, just like hold them in a three spot like this and you're running the knife up and down just outside your knuckle. So this way you're not going to keeping your fingertips in. This way you won't slice your fingers up. So I put it into a julien and then uh, give it a fine dice. Uh, but a four tablespoons of whipping cream, I'm going to whip it up. And uh, into the whipping cream, I'm going to add a couple of drops of Worcestershire sauce. So I'm going to add in a couple of drops of chili sauce, or you could use Tabasco. Uh, we're also going to put in a little bit of white pepper. And uh, mix it all up nice. All right. And then at the end, I'm going to put in some lemon juice. I don't put the lemon juice in yet because I want to keep my uh, whipped cream nice and thick. So I've got some lemon zest here. So I've cut a piece of the lemon skin off. I want to get rid of this pith, the white part. It's very bitter. So I'm just going to skin the lemon. And that's going to fillet it and uh, probably have to fillet it again and maybe even one more time. Just keep filleting it until we get all that pith off. And uh, we want just the yellow part. gives that nice citrus flavor. Again, we're going to mince up this, this uh, lemon zest and add it into the mousse. This is such a great dish, you know, to use uh, for dipping or uh, I use often we'll do it with vegetable dip or today we're going to do it with some uh, crackers. Um, just really nice and light appetizer, nice and easy. And you can make this ahead of time, put it in the fridge. Uh, it should sit in the fridge before serving it for at least a couple hours, and that way the uh, smoky flavor will disperse into the entire dish, as well as the flavor of the lemon and uh, the onions. While we're mincing them, we're going to start to sweat and release a lot of nice flavor. So again, we get our three-finger rule. Okay, we're going to uh, just put the uh, lime here into a julienne. A julienne just means cutting it into a small matchstick. Uh, these precision knives are fantastic. They really hold the edge very well. Great uh, German rolled steel. Um, so we get uh, the lemon zest right off there. And uh, now I'm going to mince it and we're going to uh, add that to our mix. So a quick slice of the lemon zest and just chop it all up nice. Love citrus. It always makes things have a nice fresh, fresh flavor. Alright, so we'll just put that to the side for now. We're going to grab our bowl. So this is the uh, whipped cream. After I whipped it, I put it in the fridge so it uh, would stay nice and cold. Um, we're going to add in the uh, smoked fish. So there's about 10 ounces of, uh, of meat I have here of the fish. I'm using 4 tablespoons approximately of uh, whipped cream. I have 2 tablespoons of minced green onion. Half a uh, tablespoon of uh, minced lemon. And uh, half a tablespoon of uh, minced red pepper. Three tablespoons of sour cream and probably about a half a teaspoon of lime juice to squeeze it in there. We want to mix it up. Now when you're folding this, you want to be careful. You want to fold it, not mix it, because the whipped cream has made it really nice and light. And the more you mix it up, you can start breaking down the air bubbles in the side and become a little heavier. So uh, check for seasoning and then serve it up. And that's just a great appetizer from Chef Warren at Dinner for Two. And uh, happy cooking!